Hey, so glad you're a part of the 90 day challenge. Do you have any ants in your yard? Or have you ever had any ants in your house? Aren't they, they can be like pesky little creatures, right? They can sting you. Um, they can get on, they, they can get in your house. They can get through the smallest little crevices. They're just amazing at their tenacity to get into places and to do what they do. You know, the Bible actually speaks about ants. In Proverbs 30, verse 25, it says, Ants, they aren't strong, but they store up food all summer. And Proverbs chapter 6, it says, Watch the ant. Learn from the ant. What, can, what was the writer of Proverbs trying to say to us? What was God trying to say to us in these verses? Is that the ant is steady. The ant is steady. The ant doesn't try to get it all done in one day. An ant gets a little bit at this time. And he gets a little bit more the next day, and a little bit more, and a little bit more, and a little bit more. Also, the ant knows how to work with other ants as a team. Now, when it comes to putting God first in your finances, some of you are facing a real big mountain financially. Maybe it's a lot of debt. Maybe you inherited some debt from a, a lost, I mean, a parent that passed away, or a spouse that died, and you, uh, you, it wasn't because you went out and charged up credit cards. It was just, you have all this on you. Or maybe you did charge up credit cards. Whatever. You're facing this mountain. Or maybe you're later in life, and you're trying to get a nest egg built up for retirement. Here's what we can learn today. You put God first, like you're doing. Continue to do that. And then don't look too far down the road. How can you be the most wise financially today? And then tomorrow, how can you be the most wise financially tomorrow? See, small changes lead to huge differences in your life. Small changes, huge differences. So I want to encourage you. When you see those ants this afternoon in your yard, or maybe you see one crawling across your floor, before you squish it, say, God help me. To be like that ant today and just get one step closer, get one piece put away one day at a time. Have a great day. I love you and I'm proud of you.